Yeah, in this club, I'm going to be talking about Dragon Ball Sparking Zero today, and sorry about my voice, I'm still sick. My voice was actually better today in the morning, but it's late at night now, I've done some talking, so it doesn't sound that great anymore, so I do apologize, just hopefully I get better soon, but I wanted to make this video regardless, because some people are worried about um, um, Ultra Instinct Goku and Dragon Ball Sparking Zero, and that's because... Um, of Super Saiyan Blue Kai Ken Goku and Super Saiyan Blue Mon Vegeta. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, um, in Dragon Ball Sparking Zero, you know, there's lots of Gokus and Vegetas, and you can select, um, you know, like, either base Goku or Vegeta, or, of course, you know, the transformations. Um, you don't have to um, start off as base if you want. You can just select Super Saiyan Free Goku. So there's Z Goku and Super Goku, Z Vegeta and Super Vegeta, and I'm pretty sure you know all the transformations, but... I'll talk about the super transformations. So there's Goku uh, and Super who transforms into Super Saiyan 1, Super Saiyan God, and Super Saiyan Blue. And then there's Vegeta Super who transforms into Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan God, and Super Saiyan Blue. But there's characters you can't select from the character select screen. And that's Super Saiyan Blue Kai Ken Goku and Super Saiyan Blue Vol Vegeta. And that's because their skills for Super Saiyan Blue Goku and Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. So instead of being like a character you can select from the screen, or even just transform into like, um, well, you don't run out of, I don't know how transformations work if you can like revert back while taking damage, I'm not 100% sure. I know you can um, go back to base if you want um, while you're transformed, but the thing is, they're not the same kind of transformation Super Saiyan Blue Kai can and Super Saiyan Blue Evolved where like the other tra um, Saiyan transformations, they're just basically skills, they're just buffs on, um, it's just a buff for Super Saiyan Blue Goku, and then Evolved is a buff for Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. So yeah, instead of selecting those from the character select screen, um, it's just something that the Super Saiyan Blue Goku and Vegeta can do, where they just have this skill that makes them stronger while fighting, and it doesn't last long, it's just, um, it just, I don't know how it works, like, I've seen gameplay, but it's been some time, um, but it's just there for a certain time, like, you know, I don't know, like, how many minutes or while you're in sparking, I have no idea, I kind of know what that, so yeah, people are wondering now if Ultra Instinct Goku is going to be the same as Super Saiyan Blue Kai Ken Goku, where it's not a, a transformation you can stay in, like, it's just going to be a buff for Super Saiyan Blue Goku, and... If you go to the Dragon Ball Sparking Zero website, the Japanese website, it shows you all of these characters. Um, so, this is not a, a, Kai, a Kai Ken Goku you can select from the character select screen. They just use a screenshot of Goku using his Kai Ken attack. Um, I believe early Goku Ken has a skill to turn Kai Ken. It's not a transformation, but it's a skill, so it's like a buff for um, this base Goku, but I believe mid, <laughs> some mid, some Goku mid, um, just has Kai Ken attacks and not a Kai Ken skill, so ignore the Kai Ken here, it's not saying Goku Kai Ken transformation, it's just a screenshot of Kai Ken Goku, um, so there's Super Saiyan 1 Goku, and then, then there's um, Z later, Super Saiyan 1, Super Saiyan 2, Super Saiyan 3, and then there's the Super version I told you about. Super Saiyan Blue Kai Ken Goku is not on this website as a character here, and that's because it's a, a skill, a buff for this Goku right here. That would be like putting a, te like a, a technique Goku can do here, like Kamehameha or something. It's just going to be a skill for Goku. Ultra Instinct Goku will be a character you can select from the character select screen, and maybe even Sun Goku Super can turn into while fighting. And there's four slots while, like, let's say you pick a character, like, yeah, I'll, I'll just say Sun Goku Super example. There's four slots you can transform into on characters. Um, you know, Goku can turn to Saiyan 1, God, and Blue. And then there's another slot at the bottom, um, which is nothing, in the demo, of course. And that's, and I'm pretty sure the one at the bottom will be Ultra Instinct Goku. So yeah, because of Super Saiyan Blue Kai Ken Goku not being on this um, like over here and Super Saiyan Blue Evolved Vegeta it's not going to be the same with Ultra Instinct Goku 
Ultra Instinct Goku will be a playable character you can just select from the screen. And I'm sure you can just transform into Ultra Instinct Goku with this Goku over here. I'm pretty sure they just made Vegeta get a buff instead of a transformation because they wanted to make him like Goku. Um, where Super Saiyan Blue Goku can have this buff and also Vegeta can have this buff as well. Now maybe you're saying, oh, but they haven't shown those characters in a trailer or something. There was a trailer in January where they showed Super Saiyan Blue Kai Ken Goku. And they did not add Super Saiyan Blue Kai Ken Goku um, to this list over here. And that's because it's a skill for this character. Like, this character can use. Um, it's weird though, like, with Vegeta, maybe they could have put Super Saiyan Blue Evolved as like a transformation because you know there's a fourth slot for every character which won't be for everyone by the way just I just saw that you know the, the image you're looking at right now there's four slots um, and of course not every character is going to have all of them filled up you know maybe someone like Frieza from Z will because you know second form third form final form and then 100% um, but yeah, I find it weird that they didn't use the fourth slot for Vegeta to have um, Super Saiyan Blue Evolved, you know? Um, I guess they just want to make him like Goku. Uh, but you know, who knows? Maybe the fourth slot could be like a more bulkier Super Saiyan Blue Evolved Vegeta. Because the way we have Super Saiyan Blue Evolved, um, Super Saiyan Blue Evolved Vegeta is, I mean, I, I guess sometimes it does look more muscly. He doesn't have like the pupils like in the anime. It looks more like the manga version of Super Saiyan Blue Evolved. Unless they make the fourth slot like the way he looks in the anime. And on the cover, on um, the way he looks in the cover on Dragon Ball Sparking Zero. Where you can actually see the pupils. Um, but yeah, Super Saiyan Blue Evolved Vegeta could be unfinished. They could do some touches. So either that fourth slot might be a better version of Super Saiyan Blue Evolved Vegeta. Where it's a transformation. Um, or... It can be nothing, or there's another possibility, <laughs> which I, I doubt will happen, but hopefully it does. Ultra Ego Vegeta. They really want to make Goku and Vegeta like, um, giving Super Saiyan Blue Goku a skill and Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta a skill where they transform for some time. Um, then who knows, maybe there's a chance that Ultra Ego Vegeta will come as a transformation for Vegeta and a character you can select on the screen. Or you can just, or maybe, would they really do another Super Saiyan Blue or Vegeta where he looks more like Super Vegeta but Super Saiyan Blue? Because he does, does look a bit muscly apparently, um, but he does look more like the manga version and not the way in the anime and um, the Sparking Zero cover. So yeah, the fourth slot for Vegeta is unknown at this stage or it's just going to be nothing. Um, but yeah, alright, going to here, I'm just letting you know, you don't have to worry. Ultra Instinct Goku won't be something that'll be there for like, less than a few minutes as a buff for Super Saiyan Blue Goku. Ultra Instinct Goku will be a transformation, the character you can select from the screen. It's okay, you don't have to worry, just look at this website. Super Saiyan Blue Evolve Vegeta is not here, Super Saiyan Blue Kai Ken Goku is not here. Um, and they... I mean, they did show this Vegeta screenshot where he's using fi God Final Explosion. And he does turn Super Saiyan Blue Evolved, but I feel like it's unfinished in the demo, you know. I, I feel like it's unfinished. I'm pretty sure there's going to be more touches they want to do to Super Saiyan Blue Evolved. You know, maybe... I don't know. I don't know. Just, well, only time will tell. So yeah, Vegeta will either get Ultra Ego, nothing, or another version of Super Saiyan Blue Evolved. Um, to fill up that fourth slot, but um, it might be nothing. Let me know what you think it is, if it will be Ultra Ego Vegeta, or something else, let me know, or even just nothing, which is most likely going to be the case. But like I said, if they want to make Vegeta like Goku, then give us Ultra Ego Vegeta. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Give us... <coughs> oh, Jesus. Give us Ultra Eco Vegeta. <laughs> Sparking Zero. I need to end this video now. Goddamn, bye. <laughs>